Hello everyone, my name is Chris and welcome to the channel. In today's video we are going to take a look on how you can draw in um, Microsoft Word, how you can add your signature or maybe highlight uh, different words um, or, or even uh, draw with different pens and, 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 and colors. Uh, before we jump into that one, a uh, quick word from our uh, sponsor today and uh, we'll be right back after that segment. And today's video is sponsored by CloseUp. CloseUp is an online service tool that can help you transfer files from one cloud provider to another. For example, if you have um, your files hosted on OneDrive and you wish to switch to Google Drive, that's no problem. It's all done in three easy steps. You need to select the folders and files that you wish to transfer and then choose the destination where you want them to be copied. And that's it. You simply click start and then your files will be copied to the new cloud provider. Uh, for more information, please check the link in the description below and uh, register for free and start uh, migrating or transferring your files. Welcome back. So. In order for you to start the drawing in Microsoft Word, you need to have this tab right here. If you don't see the draw here, what you want to do, find the blank space on the ribbon. For example, if you're at, at home, here at the, the home tab, go ahead on the right hand side and click, right click on uh, any blank space and then once the pop-up menu appears click on customize uh, the ribbon and you want to look for this tab here draw if you have this uncheck like this go ahead and check if you don't see it at all here on the right hand side uh, go ahead on the left hand side and choose main tabs and then click on draw and click add and then it will appear on the on the on the ribbon once this is here make sure it's checked and then click ok perfect and once you see the draw uh, menu uh, visible the draw tab you want to click on it and then you will be prompted with a few options um, on different uh, eraser pen or a highlighter tool. Let's start uh, with with the uh, with the pen. For this example, uh, it's the color selected is black, and we are talking about the signature, right? Now you can do whatever signature you want here, right? Something like this, or uh, of course you you want to do your own signature. Uh, now I'm using a mouse, but um, by the way, it's not my signature, I just did something here because it's not very uh, user-friendly, let's say, with the, with the mouse. If you have a pen or a touch um, device, like a laptop with a touch screen, that will be making it much easier for you to draw your own signature than, uh, that you can use afterwards in signing documents. Of course, if you um, did it wrong, right? You can always click on uh, erase eraser and you can of course delete it now uh, there are a few options of course uh, you can do all sorts of cool stuff even uh, <laughs> draw with rainbow color right um, and, and a ton of other things like glitter gold glitter why not uh, of course, you have an uh, option to, to, to choose different sizes of the um, and thickness of the pen. See, this is very uh, light gray. Uh, and you can change the thickness uh, right over here. There you go. It's more like a pencil. Uh, and you can also use the highlighter. So, for example, if I have a text, let me find the text right here. Might be familiar with this one. Okay, let me try and... Uh, 
increase the size here so yeah this is the the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog and if i want to check the highlighter i can uh, start highlighting uh, different um, words or sentences of course now um, if let's say oops we did a mistake you can go back click on the eraser and just delete that another cool stuff um, that i saw uh, of course by the way you can also if you click on the little arrow here you can also move things around right so for example i did this i'm gonna put it here this here there you go something like this right you can move things around and with the lasso tool this how you call it uh, this is just for you to to select different objects, right? And you can also change the size of them. So if I go back to the um, arrow, you can also increase the size of this. There you go. Now another cool thing you might be wondering: what is this blue um, pen here with the little stars? Well, uh, this is called an action pen and it's intended to be used if you have maybe a stylus or a pen that you can use with a, um, with your touch um, screen or even with a mouse but i find it very uh, uncomfortable let's say so if you click on this um, let me see if you have an option to see the gestures i think this one so you, if you need help on uh, uh seeing which exactly are the the gestures so as you can see here there are a few gestures that you can do i'll try to do, do, do it with the mouse so for example i want to uh delete the, the word brown and you can see here you have to squiggle a little bit on the lines so let's try and do this let's see if it's oops, no, I can try. there you go you see the word is, is deleted or for example you want to select word so i'm gonna select dog there you go now the now the word dog is selected and you can for example increase the size of that put it back uh what else add a new line so for example i want to add a line let's see if that works there you go or i want to split a word let's see if i can split uh lazy perfect or I want to join a word so let's see if I can merge the word back perfect uh, so you see you can do a lot of cool stuff and it, it, it's really um, natural when you have like a stylus or a pen touch pen uh, on the screen directly but anyways this is a really cool um, uh, option that you have at your disposal um, one other thing that I want to show you is if you have some calculations or uh, math exercises you can also convert the drawing into math formulas so right um, you can just click on ink to math and for example let's say i want to write something like uh, i don't know X. there you go it just recognizes and this is really cool because um it's it's uh it's it's very easy to insert this type of uh, of uh, equations if you want there you go. and there you have it so uh hopefully this was um useful for you uh if you find this um helpful please make sure to watch um my other videos on uh, tips and tricks on microsoft word please make sure you, you you give this video a like that helps the channel uh, very very much and uh, if you like the overall content please make sure to to subscribe um thank you very much and talk to you in the next one bye